when buying a mechanical watch, there's all this terminology about the movement inside. So what do they really mean? And what should you look for to make sure you get the watch with the right movement for you? BPH, and it's also known as beat rate. This refers to the amount of times per hour the balance wheel completes a full back and forth oscillation. A higher VPH generally translates to a smoother sweep of the second hand, but sometimes at the expense of a reduced power reserve. Now, speaking of power reserve, this is the amount of time a watch can continue to run after being fully wound. Sort of the reliable movements that have been around for years and produced in large quantity because they've been around so long, there's a huge variety of replacement parts available and even a larger pool of watchmakers who are more than likely familiar with servicing this type of movement. Jewels, tiny bearings, often made of synthetic sapphire. The movement would often be a lot of friction because the jewel is here. It's placed and then lubricated to minimize the wear and tear between these parts. Each movement also usually comes with its own features, sometimes referred to as complications, hacking, chronographs, perpetual calendars, moon phases, 